Once again, the outdoors are beautiful, and so I am in them. It's First off, I would like to do a little bit of News Day Tuesday and just say farewell to YouTube as we know it, supposedly. You served us well. Now for Bookworm Wednesday! My favorite segment, which you guys probably thought was gone forever, has finally returned! It's Bookworm Wednesday's Word Wall Word of the Week. And this week's Bookworm Wednesday Word Wall Word of the Week is... Amphigury, a meaningless or nonsensical piece of writing. Basically, an amphigury is like a poem or lyrics that are meant to sound beautiful and look beautiful, but don't actually mean anything. So I thought that was a pretty awesome word. Now this beautiful, beautiful weather is like such an encouragement for me to go out and read. When I'm inside, I don't really want to read as much. If I'm sitting on a couch, I just kind of want to watch TV or a movie or make videos or something like that. I don't know. Being inside is bad for reading, in my opinion. But when it's beautiful outside, I want to be outside. And when I'm outside, I want to read because it's something I can do outside. You can't watch TV outside. You can't be on your computer outside, especially if you're me and you don't have a laptop. I'm actually not gonna talk about a hard copy book today. I wanna talk about a radio show. I'm not a big fan of audiobooks. I don't know, just having someone else read a book to me is just so boring. <laughs> I can understand why some people like them, I just don't. I'd rather just read it myself, but I had this like free trial, get an audiobook for free thing. I was looking through them and I came across this one audiobook that wasn't an audiobook at all. It was a radio show. You may know Douglas Adams from Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which is a book series that I love, love, love. And I've known for a very long time that he also wrote Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency. For some reason, I've never bothered to get it. They've turned it into a radio show. I thought I would get it because I had the free trial thing and I did. And oh my goodness, it's awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness, radio shows are awesome. I love them. So yeah, they took the book and they turned it into a three and a half hour radio show thing. It's good for if you're like driving or something like that. I used it when I was cleaning my room and doing other stuff and so I was just listening to it all week. It's so funny. I love it. That's if you like Douglas Adams and weird stuff and you don't have problems with holistic things. The guy who plays Pippin, Billy Boyd, does the voice of one of the main characters. It's all English. Everyone's got an English accent, so if you're into English accents... It's so much more fun than an audiobook, just because you've got all the different characters have their own voices, and you get sound effects, and music in the background, and it's enjoyable. It's really enjoyable. Oh, I should probably give a synopsis. Dirk Gently has this detective agency and he believes in the interconnectivity of everything, that everything is interconnected. And so he sees one strange thing happen, which was kind of strange, but not ridiculously strange, but kind of strange. And he automatically assumes that it is the cause of everything, or that it's connected to all this other stuff that's going on. And so they have to figure out everything. It's got a bunch of robots and ghosts and other fun stuff. So if you like that stuff, you'll love it. You'll absolutely love it. All right, well, I guess that's all for now. Remember to use amphigury in a sentence, like if you run into a song that its lyrics are just a complete amphigury. Tell somebody that those lyrics are complete, a complete amphigury. Check out the radio show, Dirk Gently's Holistic Detective Agency by Douglas Adams, because it's awesome. And I'll see you guys later. Bye. Oh, and also, if you don't want to listen to the radio show, go outside and read, because it's beautiful.